Bob wanted to make sure we got his Clean Beach OC t-shirt here. We got, we got a turtle. <laughs> Clean Beach OC. This, this is Bob's crew of volunteers today. They're strong. Hey, everybody. Wave to us. We're the Pittsburgh guys. This is Ocean City, Maryland. Eight million visitors cross these bridges a year. Families like yours and mine to enjoy its beautiful waters, shops, boardwalk, french fries, restaurants, and 10 miles of sandy beaches. Today, we're gonna to meet Bob Bannock from Ocean City Cool. Him and his team of volunteers wanna make your stay a little more memorable. So they're out there every week pitching in and cleaning the beaches. Bob, what got you started doing this? Um, in January 2014, or 2016, Winter Storm Jonas came through and I had a bunch of friends I had made on Facebook and I said, hey, let's go out and clean the beach. It's a mess after that nor'easter Winter Storm Jonas came through. And about 25 people showed up the next day we kept doing it for 10 days straight. Um, and then after that, people just wanted to keep doing it. So we've kept doing it every Tuesday ever since. Hey, we get, we get out here every Tuesday, 9 a.m. Um, today there's about 15, 16 people that have joined us. Uh, a few of them that are down here on vacation from Baltimore and you that's down here from Pittsburgh. Hey. Um, so yeah, I'm putting you to work. Um, but we have people from Iowa, we've had them from Ohio, Florida, Connecticut that have come down here while they're on vacation and they know about us from following our Ocean City Cool pages on Facebook. Ocean City Cool page. Uh, and the Ocean City Cool group. Uh, the page is where I share mostly my pictures. The group is where 30,000 people get to share their cool stuff. Right. Ask questions. Okay, okay. Um, but they all know about it. I have roughly 60,000 followers right now, and they all know, see our posts about this beach cleanup every Tuesday, and when they're on vacation, they volunteer to help. I heard about Bob Bannock from Lisa Layfield at the Ocean City, Maryland Chamber of Commerce. And as you can see here, once Bob Bannock and his team of volunteers leave the beach, there's no trash to be found. I, I always worry when I put myself out there that nobody's gonna follow me or nobody's gonna like or see what I do. So when you decided you were gonna clean up the beach and asked, started asking people, were you worried that first day nobody was gonna show up? If it was just me, I would have been fine. Right. I, it wouldn't have made a bit of difference to me, but it was a great turnout. Uh, then the first summer, and it's funny, first summer we'd have four or five people come up and then there'd be weeks where I'd be the only one and I'd clean a dune or two, whatever it took. Next week, again, three, four, five people. And now we're up to about 10, 12 people every week. Now, I, I, the other day I was here, I ran like 10 miles. It, it ain't easy running in this hot sun. <laughs> so, so how far are you guys going? It you hydrating? <laughs> it depends how many volunteers we have each week. We'll do anything from three, four blocks to six, seven blocks. Um, but as it's growing, I'm looking to expand that and maybe even do more blocks. You know, us Pittsburghers love Ocean City. We consider that like a second home. So. Hey, we love you Pittsburghers. You're doing a great job. Bob Bannock, Ocean City Cool. What can we do to help you? The biggest thing you can do is start using more reusables. It's going to keep our everything cleaner. We're going to have less going into uh, landfills, less going to the incinerator plants. We'll just have a cleaner society. When you're here, just respect it like you would respect your own home. Uh, and I, like I said, 98% of people do. Um, there's a certain percentage that are, are a little lazy. Um, and that's all it is. All it does is take an extra minute for them to clean up behind themselves. So, um, And I know there's the young ones that like to party and see how far they can throw a bottle. Cameraman. <laughs> <laughs> how far can I throw that beer bottle? Um, but it's nothing that most of us didn't do when we were kids anyway. So we just asked for your help. You have people that aren't cleaning up their stuff. 
Is it because they don't know? Is it because they're ignorant? Is it what? Uh, is it because they don't? What effect does it have on the environment, the animals? What? The biggest thing I can say for everybody that comes to the beach is bring you reusable products. Uh, cup, cups. You don't need styrofoam cups. You don't need paper cups out here. Bring some. You bring a cooler out here, up your plastic cooler that you're going to bring back. Put some reusable cups in there. So you've got stuff that's reusable. Use your Tupperware. Use things that you're not going to throw away. The biggest problem we have today is we make too much trash. We got to just make less trash. Most people are cool. 98% of the folks that come down here clean up after themselves, and it makes my job easier. Um, and and all my volunteers. Uh, but there's that 2%, which is like anything else in society that are going to be a little bit careless. Don't be that 2%. Come on. And Bob means business when it comes to picking up the trash. So when he saw a piece that he thought he missed, he almost pushed me over to get to it. But I wasn't letting him get this one. we got to help clean up. Uh, and we're part of a community. I mean, we're all here to work together to make sure we have clean beaches so that everybody can enjoy it. So Ocean City does a great job. Then we have the Adopt a Beach program. We have the Go Green OC program. We have My Clean Beach OC program. So we're all work, trying to work together to make sure we keep the beaches as clean as we can. Bob Bannock, Ocean City Cool. Thank you for what you're doing. Really appreciate it, and thanks for giving us a minute with you today. Well, thank you for coming by and visiting with us so you know what's going on, and we can use all the help and support we can get, so let people know that we're out here every Tuesday, 9 a.m., along the beaches of Ocean City, cleanest beaches in America. This is Dominic Damaski, Discovering Inspiration. And what we found out today is inspiration is everywhere, even the beach. If you like the show, if you enjoyed it, hit the share button, tell a friend, and we're looking for more amazing and inspiring people doing really cool things like Bob Bannock and his Ocean City Cool people were doing today. Thank you very much.